So here we are with Jean Vasicek today. And she had surgery on her forehead about two weeks ago. She is 100 plus years old. Say hi, Mom. Hi. And uh, it was happened more than, I hope it was more than a month ago. It might have been a month ago, okay. Um, I have before pictures of this, but here is her head now. After major uh, uh, um, surgery on this um, wound here, where she had a little um, squamish cancer, they did a, quite an incision, and now it is almost completely healed with absolutely what appears to be no scarring whatsoever. Because uh, Scott put buckwheat honey on it for you, right? What? Several times. Scott put buckwheat honey on it for you. So buckwheat? Yes. Yes, he did. Yes, he, he did. He put winter park honey, buckwheat honey on it, and it healed like a charm, didn't it? Yes. Okay. Well, thanks for the video, Mom. Hopefully more people will learn to use buckwheat honey, and they can use it instead of manuka honey, because it's very similar to manuka honey. Vaseline, too, would work. So, well, the Vaseline's supposed to keep it from itching, but yeah. the buckwheat's what kept it Vaseline. from itching. Kept You're supposed to put Vaseline on it now. Kept it dry last night. Okay, good. Well, you could put buckwheat, continue to put buckwheat on it if you want. Or you can use the Vaseline. Really? Anyways, here's from Winter Park, honey. My mom, 100 years old. Bye-bye.